That is what makes a man of God dangerous. My mission is not to make money. Money can be controlled. So whenever you need it, you invoke it. If you think God lives in heaven, friend, you pray for years and years, you see nothing. Because what makes a man great is the spirit of wisdom. That's why the Bible treasures wisdom, understanding, knowledge in that way. Wisdom, understanding, knowledge. If these three are in perspective, if these three are received, because if you have wisdom, it means you know how to. Understanding is you understand why you're doing it. Knowledge is you can teach it to another person. That man is a very dangerous man because they can repeat their success over and over and over again because they understand it, they know how to do it, and they can pass it on. Uh, I thought I was teaching people. Is this making sense? That is what makes a man of God dangerous. Then if God gives you power or God adds power on that, now you are becoming very different. You are becoming Moses now. Moses was very full of wisdom, full of understanding. He had the fear of the Lord. He had power. He had counsel. <laughs> Moses operated in all seven. Amen. That is why he prophesied. He said, and the Lord shall give you another prophet likened unto me. He said, the one that is coming will be like me. And this was talking about Jesus' ministry on earth. Because the Lord Jesus operated as a prophet. Even though he was the Messiah. Even though he is God in the flesh. He operated as a prophet. And the foreshadow of the Lord was Moses. Moses. 